Welcome to this last video about uh, symmetry and we've spoken about lines of symmetry, planes of symmetry and rotational symmetry. Check my site explainingmaths.com where you will find all these resources um, amongst uh, all my other resources nicely organized. But I promised to do one video about regular polygons and symmetry. And what are regular polygons? Uh, well you hopefully know that that is a shape where all the sides are equal in length and all the angles are equal in size. Yeah? So for instance, a square is a regular polygon because all the sides are equal in length yeah, for a square and all the angles are also the same. Yeah? They're all 90 degrees. Okay, where a polygon, I've explained before by the way, is a two-dimensional figure uh, consisting only out of straight lines, yeah? so no curves with uh, at least three angles, uh, polus, many, gones, angles, many angles or many sides. Okay, we're going to have a look now at regular polygons. Uh, first of all, at a triangle, okay, and a regular triangle, how do we call a regular triangle? Yeah, where all three sides are equal and all angles are equal, so they're all 60 degrees. We call that an equilateral triangle. Well done. Now my question is, how many lines of symmetry does the equilateral triangle have? Well, I can fold it like this. A line of symmetry or a mirror line sometimes. Uh, then if I fold it over that line, both sides need to be the same, yeah, and they are. So, or they should be overlapping. That's one. Uh, but I can also um, fold it differently. Um, I can also fold it like this, for instance. There we go. So that will be two. There we go. So that's my second line. But I can finally also fold it like this. It's a lot of folding, perhaps you don't really see it, so perhaps it's better if I just draw the lines of symmetry. It has one line of symmetry, two lines of symmetry, and that's the third one, three lines of symmetry. So the regular triangle triangle has three lines of symmetry. And what is the order of rotational symmetry? Yeah, so if I, if I rotate it one full turn, one how many times does it look the same? Two, and then back in its original position, three. Okay, that's interesting. So the order of rotational symmetry of a regular triangle is three, and it has three lines of symmetry. Now moving on to a quadrilateral, the regular quadrilateral, so indeed that is our famous square, the regular quadrilateral. Now how many lines of symmetry does it have? Well, I've shown you in, in previous videos, it has one, Two, but also those diagonals for a square, uh, not for a rectangle, but yes, for a square. Also, those diagonals are lines of symmetry. Four lines of symmetry for the regular quadrilateral. And what about the order of rotational symmetry? One, two, three, four. Also four. Hey, hang on a minute. So for a regular, regular quadrilateral, the four lines of symmetry is also rotational symmetry of order four. Yeah? And for the regular triangle, as the three-sided polygon, Three lines of symmetry, order of three. Now let's have a look at a pentagon, a regular pentagon there, yeah, where all five sides are the same and all the five angles are also the same. And what do you think? How many lines of symmetry will it have? One. What do you think? Yeah, looking at, do you see some sort of sequence here? Two, three, four. Five, five lines of symmetry. The regular pentagon has five lines of symmetry. What about the order? What do you think? One, two, let me just put a little dot here that I know I started there. Yeah, the dot is not there, but just that I know that I started there. One, two, three, four, five. Order five, you see that? So actually I don't think I have to do the hexagon, which is a regular, uh, the regular hexagon, a regular six-sided figure. How many lines of symmetry will that regular hexagon have? Six. And how many, what is the order of rotational symmetry of a regular hexagon? Six. Yeah, so a dodecagon, which is a 12-sided figure, a regular dodecagon, how many lines of symmetry? 12. What is the order of rotational symmetry of a regular dodecagon? Also 12. Fantastic. Like and share this, guys, if it was useful, so I can help your friends too. Check my site, Explaining Maths, that's with an S, explainingmaths.com, and you'll find all the resources you need. Uh, you can also ask me questions there on the forum, and I will make sure to help you. Okay? So I wish you a very pleasant day, and uh, up to loci now. I'm going to do some construction and loci, so check it out. See you later.